Egypt has a vast experience in tourism. It's long been a major income earner for the country and is sharing the knowledge with its African neighbors. Our lecture is not an academic one, but more of a case study type of session. There's a lot of experience here in Egypt. And to be honest, I believe several of these countries need Egypt's experience. I'm delighted to see how happy they are with the information we've provided. Twenty-six trainees from 18 African countries are attending the course, many of them from emerging countries in tourism. I'm very happy to participate in this training program in Egypt because in our country we are still targeting for a million tourists a year, which we have not arrived. With the experience I have had from this training session and our own experience, I hope we are going to learn from the Egyptian government who is already targeting 20 million tourists for 2020. While we are already, we are targeting for 6 million tourists before the year 2020 in our country. The course, sponsored by Egypt, covers marketing, developing hospitality services and improving human resources capabilities. Part of our plan in the ministry is the exchange of expertise and to relay our experience with the Nile Basin countries and the rest of Africa. We started a program last March in cooperation with the Partnership for Development Division and the success led to more African countries requesting to join in today's courses. The trainees have considerable background in tourism. However, they hope they can adopt what they have learned here with the plans set forth in their countries. Well, Nigeria is endowed with a lot of tourism resources, both natural, man-made, historical and cultural. Nigeria has a tourism master plan which is already in operation. Uh, clusters have been, have been identified. The country has been demarcated into sectors. We have the scenic view. We have the, the scenic view is mainly in the central Nigeria. So with all the strategies that I have learned from this training, I am going to write it and propose to my hierarchy so that we should work in collaboration with the Egyptian government in order to increase our tourism arrivals in Cameroon. The tourism ministry said the courses have been a success and is planning to host a larger delegation in the next round. Egypt hopes that such training programs will not only help benefit the tourism industry in the continent, but will also help bring the Egyptians and the rest of the African countries closer together. Yasser Hakim for CCTV, Cairo.